Hello, my lovelies, and welcome back to Creations by Simone. And welcome back to Vlogmas, guys. We are on day number nine. I am sailing through. I don't know how I'm getting through, but I've made it to day nine so far, guys. And guess what? We have 16 more days to go to Christmas. So we have 16 more Vlogmas. Help! <laughs> but I'm going to make it. All right, guys. Today, we're going to do a Christmas baker's rack. I'm ready to do this. Now, I've only seen one of my YouTube sisters attempt a baker ra baker's rack, and that is Gigi over at Styling the Gigi Fazin, guys. I know she just did one, so I want you guys to go check her out. All right, my lovies. First, we have to get this old baker's rack cleared off because it does have a lot of dust on it. It does, it does. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and Windex it down. It has three levels. I've already done the bottom one. We're working on the second one, and then we're going to go up to the top one to clear all that dust and dirt off as well. So let me climb up here. I had to go get a chair. That's why we stopped that, guys. All right. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to clean this third row up here. And it's not too bad, considering I haven't did it in ages. It's not too bad. But we're going to get it all cleaned up because we're going to decorate it with some Christmas items. All right, my lovey. So we're going to start out with these beautiful red glasses that I got from Walmart literally about 10 years ago, guys. I've had these in every Christmas I pull them out. And we have our beautiful glam glasses here as well. I got some from the thrift store and then I got some from a store called And That. So um, we're going to go ahead and we're going to put all our red glasses in. Now these are glass holders where you turn the glasses upside down. It's um, actually six of them, I believe. Is it five? Five slots, should I say. So we're going to go ahead and put our five red glasses in there and then our five glam glasses in there. And look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Now we're going to go to the very top. These are some beautiful um, holders that I got from Hobby Lobby. I think I've used them in several videos. We put a little Epsom salt in there for some snow and a beautiful little bling bub. And we sprinkled some snow on top and it came out to a great decor piece. Now I'm going to go ahead and put my beautiful plate here that I got from Home Goods and the lovely, lovely ornaments that I got from Hobby Lobby, guys. They're so cute. All right, so I have this beautiful little wired basket. Got it from Home Goods. I got these um, oven mitts from Home Goods as well. Both sets, very sturdy and thick. You will not burn yourself with those. And these cute little kitchen napkins that I got. They were a set. One says Believe and one says Mercy. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put that all fancy smancy up there and then we're going to add our cute little reindeer now he's actually holding one of the napkins as well and i think he is so cute i you know every christmas i set him somewhere throughout the house so he's made it on the baker's rack this year now we have rudolph here that i got from michael's once again had this years and years ago or i don't know this rudolph this might be his girlfriend clarice because she has a black nose so i made a mistake there guys all right cute little candle holders i got from Dollar Tree believe it or not and we're gonna go ahead and put our red candles in there now I had to put a little paper towel inside of that so the candles would stand straight up but it did and it looks absolutely beautiful look at that guys tall regal and elegant now I'm gonna add my beautiful centerpiece here now this is just a bowl a better home and gardens bowl and these picks I got from Walmart maybe about four or five years ago they were like 98 cents a piece so these are so pretty and one thing I can say about these picks guys they hold up very well they don't fall off um so i'm really loving those i've had them for years our cute little um gnome here that we got from walmart a couple of years ago and these beads now i actually got the beads this year from walmart i love these you can do a lot with these beads but what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna add them to the top of our baker's rack guys and i have two sets of them i thought that really would look great look at that voila instant creation all right my lovey so we're just about finished that now we're going to add to the bottom portion which is a rug peace love and joy guys you gotta have that during the christmas holiday season all right my lovies that was a quick baker's rack all the items up here mainly dollar tree michael's home goods um things that i've had for years you know you never can get enough christmas stuff you accumulate over the years and 
every year you say, okay, well, I don't think I'm going to need it this year, but you always end up using it somewhere throughout your home. All right, my lovies, I hope you love this. And if you do, you know what to do. Give me that big thumbs up. We are on day what? We're on day nine, guys. And we are headed tomorrow to day 10 to Vlogmas. We are sailing on through. Before you know it, it will be Christmas morning. And I cannot wait because on Christmas Eve, we're going to do a beautiful home tour. And that is going to be the finale. All right, my lovelies, until I see you tomorrow, day number 10. Have a beautiful and blessed evening. And don't forget, happy Vlogmas, guys. Bye.